First tonight, neighbors in one Lakeland neighborhood are staring at a giant sinkhole threatening their property. When the sun comes up, crews plan to resume work to fill the 75-foot wide hole. Now, this all happened around Scott Lake Road and Fitzgerald Road in Lakeland. And 10 Tampa Bay's Hannah Deneen has been out there all night long for us. And Hannah, this is still an active situation. Now, Dave, at last check, we're told this sinkhole is still not stable, so it will be monitored throughout the evening by the sheriff's office. Meanwhile, neighbors who live along the sinkhole tell us they're packed and ready to go at a moment's notice. Others not taking any chances, getting out now. Take the pictures and important things out. We got another place to sleep down the road. We're just going to do that. The Gutierrez family home, alarmingly close to a giant sinkhole. It's probably 30 feet off our property line right now. Maybe a little less. Chris Gutierrez first noticed the sinkhole yesterday. I went back and looked at it this morning and it got bigger and then it just continued to grow throughout the day. The sinkhole formed within a retention pond. According to an investigation report by Southwest Florida Water Management, the property is privately owned by Acres at Scott Lake LLC. According to county officials, the developer recently drilled a well on this land. And we've been told that when the well was being drilled, about 180 feet, they hit, got, broke through something, a hard layer, and then it was pretty much a void down to like 300 feet. Water management has now ordered acres at Scott Lake LLC to immediately repair the sinkhole. What they're proposing to do right now to try to prevent the, the hole from opening up anymore is basically start backfilling the hole as it exists to try to stabilize those sides so they don't continue to slough off. The region has a history of sinkhole problems. Nearby Scott Lake was drained by a sinkhole in 2006, left eerily empty for years. Everything went into the center. You could see it. You could stand there and watch the stuff going. It, it was amazing. Tonight, the sight of another massive sinkhole has some wondering what's next. It's Florida, man. Gator sinkholes, hurricanes. What else? And a sinkholes are a common phenomenon here in Florida. Any estimate of how long it's going to take to fill this giant hole? Well, Dave, we're told that the backfill operation began this afternoon and will run at least through midday tomorrow. These roads will remain closed during that time so that cars driving by don't shake this earth, causing the sinkhole to potentially grow any further. We should mention that we did reach out to Acres at Scott Lake LLC for comment this afternoon. We've not yet heard back. In Lakeland, Hannah Deneen, 10 Tampa Bay.